What's up everyone? This is Ryan with UniqueApps.com. Um, today's actually today's app, I'm actually going to cover two separate apps um, in two separate videos. I'm going to cover the iGirl app and the iGirl Lite app. I'm going to start with the iGirl Lite app. And if you want the paid app, if you look below this video, you'll see this that this video is a response to the paid app. So um, if you want to see the paid version, click this link below. But here's the free version of iGirl. It's called iGirl Lite. Um, and it starts off with this menu. Actually, the first thing that I do not like about this application is that it loads this menu every single time that you change something. So I it tells you to, you. to uh, download the, um, the full version. Um, we'll go ahead and start here. You have your iGo right here. And basically what this is, which is almost, it's actually kind of a little creepy, where you just have a girl standing and, and you could like touch her like this and she'll say something. Oh. Um, and really the whole point of this app is just to look at a girl. I mean, you could spin her around like this. Um, you could look up and go up and down. You can zoom in and go down and again spin around like this. Um, so again, it's, it's almost kind of creepy that, uh, that really people would get enjoyment out of this app because it's, it's just, I mean, it's, it's a, virtual girl that you just kind of stand here and look at so like I said um, I'm actually just gonna go through this app and do a regular review so uh, I'm gonna click the settings right here and then the free application um, you can do a couple things you can name your girl right now it just says I girl I can decide what clothes she's wearing and in the free version although you can't see right now it just uh, there you go um, the only thing that you can pick is school clothes right now, the hair color, I'm going to click on that, which is blonde, but it gives you four different options. Again, I'm trying to turn my iPhone so you can see it with the glare. So we have blonde selected. You can go to brown, red, or black hair. So I'll change it to brown right there. The language, English, Russian, or Spanish, and then ethnicity, uh, Caucasian, and Caucasian is the only thing that you can select right there. So I'm going to go ahead and, um, Go back to the iGirl, and again, it loads this thing every single time, which is kind of annoying. I guess it's just waiting for the animation to load, but it's kind of annoying just having the screen here. Like it. Um, so again, here's my girl right now, and now she has uh, brown hair. Um, but again, like I said, this is just kind of a creepy application, just because there's no point to it but to but to, um, stand here and look at a girl. So... Um, in my opinion, um, I give this. I mean, I mean, it's it's obviously designed well, and if you spin it around, um, you can actually see that they wrote on the chalkboard back back here. It says, I don't know if you can read that, but it says, um, "I will be a good girl," and it's written on the chalkboard right there. So the graphics are, are obviously very good. Um, just the whole concept is just kind of. Like I said, almost disturbing, just because there's no point to this, but to but to look at this girl and oh. make her say some stuff by touching her. So, um, again, I probably give this, I give it a three and a half out of five stars just for the creativity. Um, but it, like I said, I, I'm I'm really not a big fan of the app. I just wanted to review it for you guys because um, I actually had a lot of questions asking me to review this app. So again, if you look below. This video is actually a response to the paid version of this video. So this this was for the free version of iGirl. And, and again, click the link below where it says uh, video you response. You so cute. Can I have some money? And see, so once you leave it there like that, it'll say different things like that. Um, but again, click the link to the paid version. Again, this is Ryan with UniqueApps.com. I hope you enjoyed this video view, review. And uh, please subscribe to my channel if you want to get some more reviews like this. So... Um, I hope you all have a great day.